And with that, Dale Bennett and Michael O'Brien are now members of the Chico City Council. They fill the spots vacated by Scott Huber and Cami Denlay. O'Brien and Bennett received four votes from the five council members as they were seated in the appointment process and they immediately took their seats on the council. For tonight's meeting, the City Council had major discussions about the homeless crisis. The new Tonight Action News Now reporter Carmela Karcher shows us what was discussed. In a 5-2 vote, council approved of the first reading of the ordinance to amend certain titles within the city's municipal code. Councilmember Alex Brown and Vice Mayor Casey Reynolds voted no. These amendments revolve around regulating camping and storage of personal property on public places. It was going to be an urgent ordinance, meaning the amendments would take effect immediately, but was changed after Councilmember Sean Morgan requested to make it a regular ordinance. I spoke with advocates on both sides of the issue and asked them their thoughts on these amendments. It doesn't really give the homeless any relief. All it does is spell out what it means and the environment is so limited in terms of where people can be and what they can have, what they can keep in their possession without having it taken or being cited for leaving it. Or um, The criminalization as we know it in Chico has not changed by this. If indeed the ordinance meets the minimum required for Martin v. Boise, I am highly in support of the ordinances finally getting amended, which I've been asking for, by the way, for a very long time, because we will finally be able to enforce again. Now, council will have a final reading at their next meeting. That's when they will make their final decision on the amendments. The amendments would go into effect 30 days after their next meeting, only if it passes. In Chico, Carmela Karcher, Action News Now, coverage you can count on. The city's the city council's next meeting is scheduled for September 7th.